Hey, it's Mike from the Dry Campers. Coming at you from uh, central, well, lower Texas uh, in, you know, wonderful conditions. Uh, it's raining right now. I think it's uh, like maybe 50 degrees, uh, nice little breeze. But, you know, we're pretty cozy in here. We've got a, a nice little uh, clam set up, keep us dry. Come in here, cut all of our parts, go over and, you know, install stuff in the rig. Um, the uh, the weather we're dealing with now is much different than the weather we were dealing with whenever we were doing the install on this 2015 lifestyle. Um, we were dealing with the fires. They also had high winds. There was a fire that was within 15 miles of where we were at. It didn't start until the day after we got there. So, you know, it made us super nervous because depending on the winds, you could have one of those, you know, come right at you within a matter of minutes to a matter of hours. So anyhow, back to this install. So it's a 2015 lifestyle. I'm going to cheat because it's LS39FB. So uh, gorgeous looking unit, uh, black with the orange accents, really, really sharp looking. Uh, we put 2,640 watts, which would be two arrays of 1,320 watts each. Um, with dual MPPTs, a 150-100 Victrons. We also put uh, two of the Easy Starts on the air conditioning units. We put two um, inverters on this one too, the MultiPlus uh, 3000 VA um, inverters. Uh, whenever we did the install, he had six batteries planned, but decided to go ahead and add two more. They weren't going to arrive quick enough, so we went ahead and did the build out for eight. So up on the roof, we had the majority of the panels all on one side, which meant that it's very important to the direction of which way the rig would face in, you know, this time of year when it's, uh, the sun isn't always, you know, super great as far as uh, collecting solar. So um, all of the panels on this rig were on the passenger side of the rig, which means if he were facing east, then that would put the passenger side to the south, to the southern sky. So you would have your best chance of getting the, the collecting sunlight from the front of the rig, sorry, the hitch of the rig facing east. So um, that's very important in uh, people who full-time because, you know, if, if you're not collecting, like say that the rig was faced the other direction, and the, the panels are on the opposite side, as well as you're gonna get the shading from the AC units and other appliances that are up on the roof. So you could probably count on half, half the amount of solar uh, collection because the, of the way that you're facing. So hope you enjoy the video. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button and the dingy bell ringy thingy. I'm Mike, see you later.